Hi, I'm George Cow, and in this short video, I want to give you a simple, ongoing launch or enrollment plan to get enough clients in your business. Um, let's say that, and then hopefully as I'm talking here, you'll enjoy the, the background. Uh, I'm in Golden Gate Park, San Francisco. Uh, this is Stowe Lake. Beautiful, right? The bridge as well. So um, let's say you launched once your services and you still need to get more clients. What do you do as, as an ongoing enrollment activity? So let me give you a three-month cycle. Here's a three-month cycle that you can keep using. Just cycle through these three months and let me know how it goes. You, let me know if you have any questions. So the first month, first month is you contact your warm contacts about the fact that you have openings in your client base and you're looking forward to serving them, etc. Your warm contacts include your previous clients, if you have any, people you've already worked with in the past, chances are they need more work with you. And so you contact them about, and I, I just did a video prior to this one was about how to contact your previous clients. So watch that one for more information and read, read the notes there. Uh, also including your warm contacts are people who have contacted you about your services and you just need to follow up and chances are you have some of those people. They, maybe they emailed you or they, they contacted you through your website or through social media or something like that. So follow up with them, okay? But part of your warm contacts is also your email list. So maybe you have some, an email subscriber list. Time to let them know that you have openings in your client base, that um, this is the kind of things you do with your clients. You list some bullet points. You give maybe two or three testimonials and you offer a free complimentary call to experience what it's like to work with you. Okay, and also part of your warm contact, still part of the first month. Now you could use this as a two month cycle, if you, two month uh, duration if you want, but depending on how quickly you work. Uh, your, your warm contact also includes your social media. So wherever you're active on social media, you post to your Facebook or your LinkedIn, Google+, Twitter, uh, Instagram, etc. cetera. Um, so, okay, so that's the first cycle, the first month or two. Okay, the second cycle or the second month or two is you contact uh, leaders of online groups and offer yourself up as a resource on your topic. You're not trying to sell them anything, but you, you, you go to certain online groups like Facebook groups or LinkedIn groups where you've noticed that there are people asking the type of questions that, that you love helping clients with. And so you basically offer, uh, contact the leaders of those groups, the manager, even the active people, and say, hey, just want to say thank you for, for, for facilitating this awesome group. And I, what I want to offer myself is as a resource. If you happen to have anyone contacting you or posting questions about this area, please let me know. I'd love to answer as many questions as I can and just help people however I can. And of course, if it's really right for them to continue working with me as a client, I'm also open to, to that possibility. <coughs> and you might even mention that commissions is available if it's appropriate for them. Otherwise, you just want to help as many people as you can. I have a specific video and more details on that that I'll link to about the strategy. And then the third cycle, the third month or two, is that to use LinkedIn, because LinkedIn is a business network, to contact people who might be referral partners for you. So people who are other experts, other businesses that probably have an audience that are similar to your ideal clients, but they, that business themselves, don't serve the clients in the way that you do. So contact them about, say, hey, if you have anyone who needs, needs this kind of service I offer, keep me in mind. I'd love to help them out as much as I can. If they're right, I'll serve them as a client. And then you can broach that commission conversation if it's useful. So here's the key to all this, and then let me end the video in this way. Don't, especially for the, for, well, for all three of these cycles, don't stop at saying, well, George, I contacted 10 people and nobody signed up. No, you got to contact 50 people in any one of these cycles before you make a judgment on whether that strategy worked. So hear me out, 50 people, okay? And I would say also, every 10 people that you contact, you need to change your message just a little bit to test out, it's called split testing, test out whether a different message would be even more effective and helpful. So 50 in each of these three cycles before you make a judgment on whether this is a good strategy for you. So uh, let me know if you have any questions, open to your updates as well. And until the next video, I wish you well.